Hi everybody. Uh, this is a little bit different video than what we've done before. Uh, it is a collab we're doing with several other YouTube channels. This is our top 10 small YouTube vlogs that we discovered in 2017. Um, so we're going to go over those with you now. This collab is being hosted by Unapologetically Gomes. Uh, the playlist can be located in the description below. Uh, and they are actually our first vlog on our list. Uh, this vlog, this list is in no particular order. Um, all of these guys, we really haven't you know, ranked them according to uh, their popularity, how much we love them. So this, uh, it just seemed like the natural first choice. So anyway, unapologetically Gomes. Let's give them a tour of your head. See what we're cutting before and after. Uh, <laughs> Anna, Anna you take a couple of pictures of Dad for the before and after. All right. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Okay. Now you got the full, <laughs> the full view. Here we go. Oh, you gotta take the red thing off. Oh, the red thing must come off. So as you can see, uh, it's it's a family of four. They're in California. The, uh, the husband and the wife and the son and the daughter, they're, they just, everything they do, that they do uh, with enthusiasm, or it's just fun. They have a good time. Uh, they all interact so well. And it, it, yeah, I'm sure, you know, normal families, but they just seem to really enjoy each other's company. And when they go out and do things as a family, it's just really refreshing to, uh, to watch their videos and see how they all interact. And uh, we, we just love that. They're great. So you're going to want to check out Unapologetically Gomes. There is a link to their uh, channel in our description. And you won't regret it. Okay, number two on our list is Mr. TB's Vlogs. What's up, everybody? And welcome to another edition of TB's Restaurant Reviews. Today we're actually going to go over the $1, $2, and $3 menu at uh, McDonald's. And I'm actually going to review an item off their $1 menu, which is their sausage uh, burrito coming up. So I stumbled across uh, Mr. TB a few months ago, just kind of at random. I'm not really sure at what led me to his channel, but I watched through several of his videos and I really liked his honesty. And he just kind of, his, as his t-shirts sometimes say, his whatever kind of attitude like I he's like I don't care this is like this is my opinion these are my thoughts this is my life and it's fun he's great uh, a lot of fun to watch and he's got two uh, adorable dogs that are they're really cute we're dog people um, but he is the most supportive youtuber I have ever met uh, watches almost every single one of our videos uh, even when his own personal life is stressful because you can see in his videos all the stuff he's got going on but he still makes time to watch ours he comments on all of our videos he has the nicest sweetest things to say <laughs> and I always enjoy reading his comments and as Sarah said the other day Mr. TV is so nice and I'm like yeah he really is a nice guy genuinely nice guy so uh, he's got great recommendations. I really enjoy his restaurant reviews because he does like fast food places. You know, people don't do fast food place reviews like that. It's just it's cool to watch. But anyway, we highly recommend Mr. TV's vlogs. So speaking of supportive YouTubers, number three on our list is the Three Roots family. are a husband and a wife and a son and another Texas family and they are really sweet people um, they have a lot of great content that they produce a lot of daily vlogs challenge videos games and kind of like our family their son is the the focus of the of the channel which we like 
Um, Jacob really likes her cooking videos and if you'll remember in the challenge video she did shrimp we fumped in with ground turkey but she <laughs> she whips out the shrimp and does something delicious and they are um, just so nice and they say the most wonderful things about Gabriel and make lovely comments on our videos and I always like to read those as well and they just think Gabriel is the cutest which he is obviously <laughs> So we highly recommend Three Roots Family and you should check them out too. Next on our list is the beginning of a beautiful bromance <laughs> for Jacob. <laughs> so, so number four on our list is the uh, Henrik's Family Vlogs. Uh, here you go. A salty and laxative. <laughs> <laughs> so today we're gonna make bath bombs and I got these super cute grenade bowls because so bath because, grenades yeah that's all right because who wouldn't want to put a grenade in a bath <laughs> okay so uh this dude he, he's actually become a friend um he's <laughs> Sarah says my, my YouTube buddy um <laughs> <laughs> and I've roped him into some to a, to a to a collab, and I usually end up tagging him. I, I convinced him to let his uh, wife put makeup on him, which he did not enjoy at all. <laughs> it was fun, um, and he, he and I say he's a friend because he's an actual friend. Like we we communicate. We're planning a meetup um, in the next few weeks. So anyway, Hendrick's family vlogs. Uh, it's it's Skylar and his wife. And they're two kids who are, they're awesome kids. They're good family. Uh, he's a veteran. They're a Texas family. Um, they've been at it for a few months. I, I really enjoy his shooting style, kind of, kind of the way he does his, his vlogs. Um, they're, they're kind of shifting their channel into a new direction and doing some more how-to videos and uh, game nights. They like to play a lot of games, which uh, I'm hoping to be a part of. Uh, some future game videos because they they have a good time. Do they? I'm super competitive. I don't want to ruin the friendship by being terribly competitive. <laughs> we just won't invite you to the next one. <laughs> so anyway, Hendrick's Family Vlogs. Uh, they're a great channel, and we think you guys should check them out. Number five on our list are our Canadian brethren up north, the MP8. You call it chaos. And we call it family! Welcome to the vlog. It's Wednesday morning. I don't know what time it is. It's quarter to eight. Dad's leaving for work. Courtney's getting ready and she's gonna be on time this morning, right, Courtney? Caroline's heading off to basketball practice, right, Caroline? Wednesday, my dudes. So, Kathy and Cliff have six children. Six, which is kind of amazing to me. And they live a minimalist lifestyle, which is also super amazing and fascinating to me. I think four of the girls live sleep. Uh, oh, I don't know. I don't know about that. Or they're all in one bedroom. Uh, which, I don't know for sure. That's amazing to me. I don't, <laughs> I don't know how that would work. But uh, they are daily vloggers, which is also amazing because that's exhausting as well. But it's really cool because their kids help out with the vlogs, the editing and everything. They do a lot of fun videos. Uh, I follow Kathy on Instagram and she's been posting all these wonderful pictures from Disneyland. Jacob just told me that she's there by herself. Well, she's there with, with her with Well, a she's not friends. with the family. Right, basically. the family's not there. Which I also think is really cool. <laughs> well, kid free vacation so um, they are really good people we enjoy watching their vlogs and we think that you would like them too hashtag team cliff <laughs> I think it's the second bromance we've got going <laughs> <laughs> so be sure to check out the mp8 okay number six on our list is the Whitaker family vlogs Today's gonna be pretty quick on this because I don't wanna have a super, super long vlog. I know yesterday, yesterday was short. I, I don't wanna put up a short vlog. So we're gonna kinda make this a, a nine, 10 minute vlog, hopefully, man. Hopefully, if I run long, just stay with us, baby. But yeah, man, you, it's weather, man. It's beautiful out here, man. God has made another beautiful day, man. So let's enjoy it. So this family 
is in Alabama, and I think they're a ton of fun to watch. Like, I'll, I'll be watching, and I'll, I'll admit that I'm the primary fan because I don't miss a single one. And like, I, and I have the bell turned on for everybody uh, that we're mentioning in this vlog. Um, but there's a certain like, oh man, there's a new Whitaker video when when I see that notification, and, I, and I'll immediately pull up on my phone. Uh, they're hilarious, uh, <laughs> especially, uh, and I tweeted this out um, the day, I guess, that, that they posted it, when they were at, uh, they were in Gatlinburg for their wedding anniversary, and they were going to Obergatlinburg, right, riding the, uh, the ski lift, I guess, oh, it was hilarious, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put the link to that video in this thing, because that was the funniest, but they're another awesome family, um, and the two young children. The two young children. The dad's the main vlogger, uh, and they're just encouraging, and they they're just a good example of family. Uh, love each other. They're just another refreshing family to watch and really enjoy it. Uh, and being they're from Alabama, so they're kind of they're down in the coastal area, which kind of reminds me of home. So. I enjoy that aspect of it too, but I really think that you guys are going to enjoy uh, Whitaker Family Vlogs and you should check them out. Number seven on our list is someone I really admire, Pam Williams Vlog. In case we didn't have enough fun yesterday with the wood, we're going to have another adventure today, moving calves. So look here, we have like a barricade set up, a, a trail of vehicles. To lead the cattle. Kyle is supervising from inside the golf cart. Pam is a really strong woman and a great mother. She takes care of everybody in her family. She's got two sons, an older one who has managed to, I think, almost break every bone in his body. But <laughs> Working on his bingo card. <laughs> he keeps on kicking. <laughs> Um, and then her younger son who has special needs. And I really enjoy the videos of her interacting with her younger son just to see the way they communicate and the bond they share. It's something that's really, really amazing and I like to watch. She is a former nurse, which I think is cool, and is really involved with her church and the local food pantry. So, and she comments wonderful things on our vlogs and helps me get Jacob out of his comfort zone. <laughs> she uh, helps me do that. So I think that you would really enjoy her channel and you should check her out. Number eight is the Durenberger family. Don't help him escape. <laughs> Travis, no, Travis, no, stop it. <laughs> Weston, you don't need to go out. Weston no, no. Dean. Weston, ah, no, 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 oh jeez, oh jeez, he's gone. Weston, hey, I'm not talking to you, you're talking to that, that one right there, that one, hey. This is another Texas family. Um, the husband is active military, and they have three, uh, Wonderful, wonderful children, uh, and their youngest is about Gabriel's age, just a little bit younger. So, it's it's really enjoyable for me to watch other parents that are going through some of the things that I'm going through. You know, as a stay-at-home dad, um, uh, the the mom does mainly the the vlogging, and uh, she's stay-at-home mom, so I get to see her interacting with her kids and the things that she does on a daily basis which are some things that I will be doing on a daily basis, like taking the kids to school and things like that, but um, also watching her interact with their youngest son and, you know, watching him learning to walk and learning to eat and all those kinds of things. It's a, it's a lot of fun. They also, similar to our vlogs, they do have, um, I'd say, Lots of good baby footage. Lots of good baby footage. So if you enjoy our baby footage, I believe you'll enjoy their baby footage. <laughs> uh, because their kids are adorable and they're fun to watch. So we encourage you to go check out the Durenberger family. 
Next up on our list at number nine is Happily Ever Minimal. Today's video is going to be a DIY for some deodorant. The recipe that I use uses really, really simple ingredients that you probably already have in your cupboards and it's super cheap, like I'm talking really cheap. The amount that I made, I'm guessing it's gonna last me anywhere from six months um, up to a year. And let me tell you this guys, it really does work, like absolutely works. So I'm gonna get right to the DIY and show you here the whole process. I hope you enjoy this video guys. So this is another minimalist channel, which I feel like that's a, a theme for me, probably subconsciously what I need to be doing in my life, but this is a really interesting lifestyle channel. She is all about minimalism, zero waste, recycling, cleaning, really, really fascinating stuff. Like, it's so soothing to me to watch her <laughs> cleaning videos, and I really like those. But um, a lot of good how-to videos, and if I ever get free time, I'm going to just go through the whole backlog and learn how to do things because there's a lot of topics that I really want to know more about. So I really enjoy her channel. She made dryer balls. Oh yeah. that's a, I really want to make the dryer balls. That's what inspired balls. us to do our dryer balls. <laughs> like, I would love to be less cluttered and so, yeah. Happily ever minimal. We okay. both really enjoy watching her do stuff. I think we need to go that route. <laughs> get rid of all well, this stuff. We need to. And it's gonna it would take it would be a gradual process because she's a a, a point that we would say is admirable. Yeah. Because like, you know, somebody owns something or decides they're gonna do something, like she did it and she is done. You know? So it's it's really impressive what she's done. So, you know. a good lifestyle channel for you to check out. And you should check it out. Okay, and number 10. The last, last but not least. The last but not least on our list is uh, Brad and the Boho. This vlog was a late December discovery. Like I think I might have had three or four days left in 2017 when I found them. Uh, and I discovered them through Facebook, actually one of our YouTube Facebook groups. I saw a video and went, I kind of like this. And so I clicked around, watched a couple of the other videos and uh, really grew an appreciation. They're uh, enjoyable to watch. They remind me of uh, people we'd be friends with. You know, down to earth, uh, <laughs> it, it just, Brad cracks me up because uh, Megan is, is the, the, the wife, boho. the boho, <laughs> and she um, does the primary, primarily does the vlogging. And usually during the intro of the video, Brad will walk by, behind her and go, hey. <laughs> And it's usually usually cracks me up because I'm, I'm I'm watching the video and not really thinking about the fact that he's about to do it and then he does it and I remember that he always does it and it kind of makes me laugh. Um, but it's also I won't call them antics because it, it, they're like the things he does are serious and legitimate. But I enjoy watching them because they seem like it just kind of seems like if I were there with him, it'd be kind of funny and we would enjoy doing it. So, I uh, watched him cut down a tree today. Missed a crepe myrtle by like three feet. And it was a dead tree, so when it hit the ground, it exploded. <laughs> I mean, it was cool. They live in the Carolinas. Like I said, um, they were a late discovery, so I haven't seen any of their like summertime antics. Uh, but right now, there's a lot of snow in their videos, and it's beautiful. And um, they're down to earth people that I really enjoy watching. So, I think that you would enjoy watching them too. So, check out. Brad and the Boho. There you have it. All 10. <laughs> Our 2017 discoveries. And we have discovered a few uh, here recently. Some of our, our networking has kind of taken off and we've met more people uh, that I kind of feel bad for not mentioning. 
Nick Barrows um, because technically I found them in 2018, so they don't fall on this list. So we'll have a 2018. So when we have our 2018, the, the our newest editions will will make the list. But the one thing I really wanted to make sure to point out about these vlogs that we follow, um, they're they're real people um, that are small YouTubers, so they don't have the budgets that you know that you're gonna find with um, like Ellie and Jared's and the you know the big name people. Uh, camera equipment is what you and I would have, like normal people would have. Uh, no drone footage. Not saying if they do introduce drone footage in their vlogs, awesome, congratulations you guys. Would love to have drone footage. <laughs> but what what drew me to them is they're real people um, talking about real things, using real equipment, uh, not professionally, professionally lit videos, you know. But they're enjoyable. They're positive, uh, you know, in the middle of what it's kind of a sucky time. <laughs> you know, anytime you turn on the TV, it's most of the time it's negative stuff. So, and, uh, you know, YouTube has got a lot of negative stuff on it. But these, these 10 vlogs uh, are kind of a positive, encouraging light in that darkness. And so we really hope you guys check them out. Again, thank you so much to um, Apologetic Gomes for inviting us to be a part of this collab. Uh, be sure to check out the playlist in the description. Give this video a like. Leave us a comment if you feel like we left somebody out or somebody you would like to share with us so that we have uh, some new people for our 2018 list. So share your discoveries with us. And uh, be sure to subscribe to us. Click that bell. We post three times a week. Thank you all for watching. <laughs> See you all next time.